wind power generator do it yourself low RPM three phase rotor and magnet assembly part 1A from our previous instructions plate steel 5mm thick has been machined and placed on the wheel side of the hub assembly additional magnets have been placed on that sheet steel with the poles directly opposing the existing magnets already glued in place so where there was a north we now have a south opposing where we have a south we have a north it's important to understand that the magnetic flux is set up like a beam across the gap where the coils will be sitting once the magnetic flux goes into the steel it knits with the next magnet inside the steel this can be demonstrated by putting a metal screw somewhere on the sheet steel further away from the magnets the only way that can be attracted there is by the flux that's flowing through the steel so you can imagine when the coils are in that gap and the hub is spinning with the mag magnets in place that beam of magnetic flux is very strong and when it cuts the coils will release electrons to give us the current flow and the voltage. It's important concept.